Rocket League is a very fun game to play whether you're a beginner or you're a seasoned veteran who knows how to do air flips and stuff. But when it doesn't work, it really doesn't work. My name is Yadullah, you're watching Candido Technology and in this video we're talking about how you can fix Rocket League not starting when using Epic Games because you can't use Steam now anyways. Now that Rocket League has been removed from Steam and it's been a while, you cannot play it anywhere other than Epic Games Launcher if you want to play it on PC which can be a problem because sometimes Epic Games Launcher can keep Rocket League from opening up. Uh, so here's what we're going to do as sort of a first measure to fix this. Press Windows key plus E to open the Windows Explorer and in here we are going to go to Documents. Uh, in this list let's find Epic Games or just Games. I'm not exactly sure. Yeah, my games. Uh, and then you will see uh, a bunch of games saved here. So these seem to be a combination of my Steam and Epic Games games collection. So I'm not sure why this is here. But we are interested in the Rocket League folder. All you have to do is uh, right click. Then uh, we can click on this button to rename and then add any word to it for example i can just call it rocket league old press enter and now try relaunching rocket league again so this will start it will create a new folder in this uh, directory and it will start off with uh, fresh save files and then it will be forced to sync your progress with the server the next step that we're going to do is that we're going to check for uh, unverified game files or any missing game files that rocket league needs to run so let's go ahead to and open up Epic Games Launcher. We'll give it a second to load everything up. It takes a while to get up and going. Click on library. And now I'm just going to find Rocket League in here. Once you're here, click on these three dots and then click on manage uh, from this menu. Uh, in here the first option that you will see is verify so go ahead and click on this this will take a minute or so just to make sure that everything is up and running so you can see that rocket league is currently queued and uh, undergoing installations and verifications this will make sure that you get any missing files that uh, the game needs to run and that everything works up to par once this is completed you can go ahead and relaunch rocket league and it should work just fine The next thing to do is to run Rocket League as an administrator and with the full screen optimizations turned off. Now to do that, we'll head over to our Windows Explorer and to whatever location you've installed uh, Rocket League in. In my case, it's on my games drive, then Epic Games, then Rocket League, then Binaries, then Win64 and then I can scroll all the way to find my Rocket League executable file. Right click this and head over to properties. In here, head over to the compatibility tab and make sure that disable full screen optimizations and run this program as an administrator. Both these options are checked. Once uh, you've checked both the options, go ahead and click on apply and then click OK and then try running Rocket League. It should have fixed the problem. So the next thing that we're going to do and this is a just in case scenario is that we're going to check whether or not Rocket League is allowed through Windows Firewall. So uh, press the start menu and search for um, Firewall. In here you will see this option called allow an app through Windows Firewall. Click on this and uh, an allowed apps window will appear. Now in this window we're going to scroll down and search for Rocket League. So I have Hellblade 2 it takes to pqr riot client and as you can see i have a rocket league in this list and it's allowed to go through uh, my private and public firewalls if you don't see rocket league in this you can click on the change settings button and then click on allow another app click on browse and now you can browse to wherever your rocket league executable file is saved once you're done come back here and then click this add button Make sure that it's allowed through both private and public firewalls just for good measure and then you'll be good to go. Last but not least, if you haven't been able to fix your issues so far, uh, you can try looking for a GPU driver update or for a Windows update. 
so for a gpu driver update you have two options number one is that you can use either your amd or nvidia uh, utility that comes with the driver so for example i have an nvidia gpu so i can just head over to geforce experience give this a second to load up um, then head over to the drivers tab and then you can just click uh, check for updates as you can see a small window will appear this will check to make sure that you have the latest game ready driver available uh, in my case that is true so we don't need to do anything in uh, gpu drivers uh, alternatively you can also use device manager to check for gpu drivers so just right click the windows start menu icon and click on device manager in here double click to extend display adapters and you can also see your integrated and dedicated gpus right here just right click them and click on update driver we don't recommend this method because this doesn't always get you the best drivers possible so if possible go through your amd or intel uh, or nvidia or intel if you have an arc gpu utility to make sure that you have the best drivers possible once you're done with that it's also a good idea to check for a windows update so press windows key plus i to open windows settings and head over to windows update uh, as you can see i have updates that require download and installation so make sure that all updates on your system have been installed and that nothing is causing games or programs from running and then rocket league should be running just fine on your pc if you like these videos consider subscribing give us a thumbs up press the bell icon and tell us in the comments below if these videos helped you or if you'd like to talk about anything else that's related to tech if you want to know more about tech visit our website candid.technology follow us on social media follow me on instagram or twitter and we'll see you in the next video